we were discussing one night, well, all kinds of things, you know, as we would, you know, over a bottle of wine, and uh, <laughs> we just kind of stumbled on the subject of uh, not the Ouija board as such, but how when we were both teenagers, um, we both had these groups of friends. I mean, she was she lived in the Midlands, I was in the Northwest. Uh, different groups of friends, but we both. Uh, both groups did the, the Ouija board thing um, and I said that I was always convinced that somebody was pushing the glass and she said yeah I, I had exactly the same feeling you know and as the conversation uh, kind of developed I said well why don't we give it a go you know and I felt a bit foolish doing that because I actually thought we'd be sat there for God knows how long you know, asking, is there anybody there? And the, with a stationary glass. Uh, but uh, I thought, well, the whole thing with me was just the idea of, of giving it a go and promising each other that um, neither one of us would, um, would influence the movement of the glass at all. So we cut out the letters, put them in a circle, did a little yes and no at opposite ends. Put our fingers on the glass and asked the, you know, <laughs> the inevitable question, is there anybody there? You believe in the other side You say there's something more Let the river take you home No preconception Let the river He said that oftentimes we'd walk together Although I'd never seen him by my side Helping each other He traveled with me and was my guide. <laughs>